Hi, my name is Sully Richardson, and I am the Community Education Program Manager here at Desert Financial Credit Union. And today I am excited to talk to you about understanding the basics of credit. And so the first thing that we want to talk about is credit. Like, what is it? And the simplest definition of credit is the ability to obtain goods or services before payment. And so there's two parts to making up credit. First, the principal amount, which is the amount that you're actually going to borrow. And then second is the interest. And that is the amount that the lender is going to use, is going to charge you for actually borrowing the money. And so there are many reasons why people borrow money. And what comes to mind that's probably most common is borrowing money to buy a house or to buy a car. But there are some unusual circumstances or unusual reasons that people borrow money and they might not think of it as unusual, but if you are using your credit card for trips and clothes and entertainment and you're not paying it off, that means you're using credit. So there's two major types of credit that we're gonna talk about. Uh, secure credit, which is secured by obviously the house or the car or whatever that collateral looks like. And then you've got the unsecured credit, which is most common known as maybe credit cards or lines of credit. And then we have the credit score. The range for credit scores based on the FICO model is anywhere from 300 to 850, which is a plus plus credit. 90% um, of lenders use the FICO model when they are approving loan applications. 35% of what makes up your credit score is your payment history. 30% is amounts owed. 15% is your length of credit history. 10% is new credit. And then the last 10% is the types of credit. And types of credit is really referring to um, having a good healthy mix. So not having all credit cards. Maybe there's a secure loan, maybe you have a credit card, maybe you have a student loan, just having that variety. And so ways to improve your credit score would be to make on-time payments. And so that means that if you have a loan, you do not want to be more than 30 days late. Um, the other way to get credit established or to improve your credit is to apply for a secure credit card. And what that means is that you're going to put um, funds into an account and then the lender will give you a credit card with a credit line based on your deposit. So in essence, you are borrowing against yourself and then you get to establish a credit line. So get it and use it for at least six months because that's gonna give you a trade line or a history. So it takes about six months to get that established. And if you have um, revolving lines of credit and credit cards with high balances, you wanna work on bringing those balances down because it, if you have a high balance on credit cards and revolving lines of credit, it could affect you in a negative way and bring down your credit score. So I hope the information has been helpful to you on um, credit and understanding credit basics. If this information has been helpful, please leave comments in the section below. Thank you so much.